Girl, are you ready? Why are you not ready? It's time for the beauty videos, girl. Hey guys, so today I'm very excited because it is the first beauty video, real beauty video dash review of the channel. So it's it's popping right now. Like, are you excited? I asked y'all, are you ready? Because I'm ready. Okay, so first to start off, before I even start talking, this video is not sponsored. I did not reach out to the company. I did not ask the company if I could make this video. This is all in my personal opinion based on personal experience. So, hey. So, this from the title, I need to get my title straight because, hey. <laughs> look, you <laughs> gotta get it right in this video. I did, all information has to be on point. And if you see me looking down, it's because I've written everything down that I'm gonna talk about because I need to stay on track because there's a lot of things to say in this video. And I can rap all day about this company because it's popping. So, this is the, in my opinion, the best affordable virgin hair my opinion some y'all may think there's other companies that are better but this is the best affordable virgin hair in my opinion on aliexpress so this hair is from well wigs virgin hair boutique on aliexpress now they do have a website their own website as a company if you're worried about the fact that you may not receive your hair or you may get a bad batch but to be honest i don't think any of those things are going to happen when you're working with Well Wigs Virgin Hair just because their branding and their customer service is on point. It's popping. If it wasn't popping, Wrigley Tay won't be talking about it. All right. <laughs> you know, she won't. They do have bundles and wigs on their website and that they offer. So they offer Brazilian, Malaysian, Peruvian, and Indian, and Cambodian. So you do have a variety of hair you could choose from for one company for the affordable aspect of things the reason why i think it's so affordable is because they always have hot sales and discounts you're not going to go i don't ever think you're going to go on, on aliexpress click on roll wigs and they not have a sale when i wore my hair it was a sale i think i believe it was 30 percent off at the time on june 11 which was yesterday I checked they have 40% off right now and so for the exact bundles that I'm gonna show you and tell you that I got they are selling it right now for 140 140 and some change maybe but 140 is like the rounded price that they're selling it for and I got mine for 160 so they always have sales and discounts and I think that's very good for somebody who's starting off with just buying their first set of bundles of virgin hair Cause you're not gonna go and get virgin hair for a hundred dollars. You're not gonna get it for fifty dollars. And if you are, they're playing you, girl, and don't use a credit card. It's not virgin hair if you're getting it for less than one sixty. Okay, let me not say that because Woe Wigs is having to sale. Whatever is less than Woe Wigs, I wouldn't fool with it. <laughs> like, check Woe Wigs first before you start. Going talking about oh girl, let me get my first set of bundles for fifty dollars. Don't do that. Check what wigs. Like I'm not even spot getting sponsored, and I'm telling you to go to what wigs. Like trust me on this because this was actually my first time buying virgin hair. My personal experience. So I bought three bundles of Brazilian Body Wave in a 18 inch, a 16 inch, and a 14 inch, all for 160 dollars and I think 18 cents. Yeah, because I checked my receipt yesterday. <laughs> um, yeah, like I said, this was my first time, and I feel like, I don't know, my first time buying, it was just like, uh, okay, I got me some bundles now. <laughs> like, but anyway, their customer service is on point. They're sending you emails and messages throughout and after you get your hair. It ships in three to four business days, which I think is because, you know, you, you buy some on AliExpress, it won't get there until a week, a month, a year. It's like, no. But it takes a while from overseas. So I think that's really good. It does ship through DHL. You do have to make sure you're there so that you can sign for your hair. 
I'm not, I wasn't there when, um, my hair got here, but they sent me a note saying, uh, we left your hair here, so we not responsible for if you don't get it, basically. Not your hair, but your package. But, so, let me say this. The hair does come packaged very nicely. It come, Mine came in a pink box. I think now they have a kind of rainbowish tie dyes box but it did come it does come in a box and it has well wigs on the on the box like what is this the top of the box <laughs> um the hair is individual like each bundle is individually packaged mine came with the yellow ribbon around it and it came in a body wave shape it didn't smell funny so it came very nicely it was ready to be used they sent you a card um Saying how you how to properly use your hair and wash your hair and all that. And I think that was very great because some people who don't know. That's why I said this is very beginner friendly. Because some people who don't know how to care for virgin hair. You know, they end up messing it up. So, that was very good for them to have in there. Um, so, I installed this hair two times. And both times, the hair was worn more than three months. Usually, I don't keep sewings in for more than two and a half months but this time I tried to push the edge with three and it lasted great um the reason I kept them in is because both installs I had something to do which the first install I had to go to a program and I couldn't take my hair out so it was in for maybe an extra through two weeks two and a half maybe and then the second install I had to perform during the second install, I had to perform at homecoming week, so I couldn't take my hair out. Like, I couldn't be looking a mess because actually, I was supposed to take my hair out on the day homecoming happened October 15th. I was supposed to take my hair out. I got my hair done in August, supposed to take my hair out October 15th. I didn't take the hair out till August 29th, like August 30th. Like, it was a mess, but both times the hair was in great condition. And the first install, the hair was fine. Like, I, you know, I washed it and conditioned it, but it was fine. But after the second install, it did need a lot of TLC. Um, but it did bounce back perfectly. So that's where, did I just drop it? That's where I want to show you this hair. Um, I'm not too sure ex what these exact lengths are because, um, they probably are all the same things because the first time I received my first install, the person used the fold over method, which is the method I prefer. The second time, I'm not talking about nobody, I'm just saying how these bundles went. The second time, um, my stylist cut the tracks and I was just like, hmm, cringy because I, you know, I'm so used to the fold over method and I like having everything in one, um, you know, and one thing, but hey, it's whatever. And so they cut the tracks, but this is the hair with this hair was, this piece of hair was actually never worn. You can see the wefts are really clean. Let me get up close so y'all can see. I just dropped everything, but I'm just going to pick it up. Okay, I just want y'all to see. So the wefts are really clean. They're never worn. Ugh. Okay, as you can see, and the you let me see, hold it this way, so you can kind of see the quality of this hair. Like this hair is amazing. The lighting is really still messed up in my room, so you know I'm not really too sure on how this is gonna go. This is my first review, so kind of cut me some slack, but it is what it is. My channel know how I roll. So as you can see, I could comb, brush through this hair fine. It may be some shedding because I haven't combed it or brushed it since I brought it back. And that was in, what? Hmm, I believe. This was like a couple, this was like months ago. But it looks kind of like, not going to say exactly, but it looks very close to the piece that was never worn. Like this was a this is one B by the way, 
I didn't say that. So this is the natural color of the hair. If my hair wasn't gray, this is like, if my front, my hair wasn't gray, this is how my hair would be before my hair turned gray. My hair was this color actually, very brown. So this was, um, had to be brought back to life. And this, the, as you can see, comparing it to the piece that was never worn, this is a little bit more wavier, but, you know, it still flows. And what? Not even gonna get into it, but let me know if y'all want to see beauty supplies throw mud. So let me know. So this is the end for this. I don't have to edit this like forever, but this is the end. Hopefully y'all enjoyed it and got y'all some wool wigs tips. So yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Love you. Disclaimer: Like, please don't cover me in some of these pictures. I know some of them look a hot mess, but look, look at the hair, not me. So these first pictures are from my first install, but towards the end, so I did take it out. So as you can see, you could curl this hair. I perm rod it, but you can curl it with heat. My hair perfectly blends with this. It looks like my natural hair. I don't know what's going on with my edges. Like, come on, bro. Oh my God, this is so embarrassing. But my hair is naturally gray. So here's a side view of the hair. I had the bundles 18, 16, and 14 inches. That's weird how I said that. But here's a back shot of the hair. Here's my natural hair blown out going into my second install with the Woe Wigs virgin hair. Here's one of the first pictures I took. I did have a side part. My first install was a middle part. As you can see how my natural hair blends. Look like my natural hair in this shot. It's crazy. Here, I just wanted to show y'all because these are my favorite pictures with this hair. Like... Let me be a well wigs model for a minute. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so here, actually, I wanted to say this hair looks crazy. And as you can see, it held up great because with the little taming, it was back normal. This is actually the day after. And so here is my last picture with this hair. As you can see, it really held up great through my, both of my installs. Again, this is well wigs Virgin Hair Boutique. This is from well wigs Virgin Hair Boutique. And yeah, cop y'all some more wigs because it's great.